homelessness in Fort Collins affects approximately 18.3% of residents. Right now I happen to be in a shed. I'm able to sleep in a shed right now. And Fort Collins Mennonite Fellowship Church wants to do their part to help alleviate the burden through the implementation of a locker program. These would be lockers uh, for people who are currently experiencing homelessness. Steve Raymer, head pastor of the church, intends to build lockers that will be located at the back of the property in hopes of helping those experiencing homelessness keep their possessions safe. I don't know how many times, you know, like on Saturday, Friday nights or Sunday mornings, people are asking me, oh, do you have any backpacks? Because mine was stolen. And is asking the city for a $10,500 grant to fund the 20 locker pilot program. Potentially, you could say in a year's time, 20 lockers every, you know, four times a year you have turnover. That's 100 people could potentially benefit. Raymer insists the project is not only valuable, but critical. All the things that you need to get a license, that you need to get a job, you know, a, a lot of these things people are losing. Plus, they're losing those things that they're pictures of their children. However, the project has stirred a concern for safety within the Fort Collins community. The security that the church had suggested, um, a 24-hour security camera, for example, was not enough to really mitigate their concerns. The two by two lockers will be put into place along this wall, allowing for those experiencing homelessness the opportunity to store their possessions. City Council is meeting tonight to discuss this proposal and decide whether or not to provide the fundings to keep the project moving forward. Council will provide direction at this meeting about next steps in the event that they decided not to fund it or if they decide to fund it. But regardless of city funding or not, Raymer aims to keep the project moving forward a move he attributes to a higher calling. The reason I'm doing this is that it's pretty clear that Jesus calls us to serve the poor and to care for the homeless. And one that will hopefully benefit the homeless population. I would use that locker too, store some stuff in it just for, you know, just in case you never know when you have to leave the area that you're at. In Fort Collins, Kiara Cole, CTV Channel 11.